Here in Nevada, one in five children face hunger uh, through charities and the government. There certainly are programs to help, but many like WIC, which was created 50 years ago to help mothers and children facing nutritional deficiencies, are underutilized by those who are in need. It's not just about baby formula. It's more than that, so much more than that. WIC is a supplemental nutrition program for women, infants, and children. It's prescription-based, focused specifically on what the mother, family, or child needs. If they don't have those uh, baseline things that we all need to grow and survive, um, it's really difficult to implement things like education. But only about half of the people eligible utilize the WIC program. Transportation is such a huge issue for a lot of our parents. Jamel Nance, the Early Childhood Policy Director at the Children's Advocacy Alliance, says getting to doctor appointments and even getting to the grocery store can be a challenge for many families in our community. There are a number of reasons why families find it difficult to engage in the WIC program. We like to see um, participants at least quarterly for nutrition education. Sarah Rogers is with the Nevada Department of Health and Human Services. We also uh, require anthropometrics. Um, to be either submitted from the doctor or them to come into a weight clinic and um, have their height and weight taken. She said they understand the obstacles and are working on solutions. And Nevada is one of five states that received an online ordering grant, so right now, we are exploring an online ordering solution for WIC families. So. And modernizing the system and improving language access. But in order to really increase participation rates, Nance believes everyone involved in early childhood development needs to be able to refer families to these resources. We need to make sure that those systems are coordinated and that they are structured in a way that's most impactful for children and families to access. In March, Congress approved additional funding for WIC, tripling the dollar amount allotted for children fresh fruits and vegetables each month and more than quadrupling the amount for pregnant and breastfeeding women. WIC also has a higher income threshold than SNAP, formerly food stamps, meaning more are eligible. When we have strong, healthy families, we have a strong, healthy workforce. In addition to food and formula, WIC also provides nutrition education along with breastfeeding support and free breast pumps. To see if you qualify, you can find a link within this story. Go to 8newsnow.com.